Hey guys, in this video I'm gonna show you how to play Fortnite Mobile on any PC and before we start I just want to say check out my video on how to increase FPS in Fortnite Season 8 so just click on the card in the top right corner. And now we can start. So first of all what you want to do is open Google Chrome and type a power mirror or just click on the link in the description and this website this website should open up and basically what you want to do now is just click on download now and as you can see this is a mirror or control android screen app for pc uh, it can be installed on iphone or android but uh, on iphone you can control your uh, your mobile so uh, this is a tutorial only for android for now okay and once it's done downloading what you want to do is just click on it click on yes and choose your language click on ok click on next click on next again next next and install and wait for it to finish and once it's done just click on finish and you can now you can now close google chrome and there it is and once you download and install app a power mirror on your pc what you want to do is open up your phone and open the play store and now you want to download a power mirror uh, on here as well so just type a power mirror click on install and wait for it to finish downloading and now just open the application so click on open click on allow okay and now basically what you want to do is open the settings on your phone so just open them and you want to enable usb usb debugging and this is a xiaomi redmi phone so uh, if you want to do that here what you want to do is just go to settings go to additional settings and there it is developer options once you click on that, what you want to do is scroll down a little bit more and enable USB debugging. And USB debugging security settings. If you don't have a Xiaomi, if you have a Samsung or I don't know, some other Android phone, just look up how to enable USB debugging on Google Chrome and you'll find the answer. And once you enable USB debugging, what you want to do is go back to the application. And now go back to your PC. And here what you want to do is just sign in in the app or create a profile. Uh, because without a profile, uh, without a profile, you can control your Android phone through your PC. So what you want to do is just click on this button. And as you can see, it says mouse and keyboard control only if you sign up so click on sign up and i already have a profile but uh, if you don't if you don't have one just click on sign up and it's pretty easy to uh to create an account okay and now once you're done uh creating your account what you want to do is go to usb connection and click on android so before, so for this you have to connect your uh, your phone and PC through a cable and when you're done connecting there it is so as you can see my phone and my PC are connected and now what you want to do is close the app and if it doesn't connect for you automatically then what you want to do is just click on the mirror button so it's in the center and, and now once you're done and you can see your phone screen on your PC. What you want to do is just start up Fortnite. And because my device, my phone is not compatible for Fortnite, I'm gonna show you how to do it with PUBG. So what you want to do now is just open Fortnite, or in my case, or in my case, PUBG Mobile. And as you can see, the game is loading. And basically, what you want to do is just click on this button here. And it says game keyboard so just click on it 
and it says that specific game detection not enabled you need to enable specific game detection to activate the game keyboard and what you want to do now is just click on enable it and this should open and basically what you want to do is just go to a power mirror as you can see click on it turn on the accessibility click on ok and basically that's it now you can go back to fortnite and now once you enable the accessibility what you want to do is just click on this key and as you can see it says game keyboard and there you have the keys that you need so you have a joystick a key a aim and fire and you can set them up by pressing on it and just press on any letter on your keyboard that you want to use for this key so for example i want to press on key on k so i'm gonna click on k and there it is and basically what you want to do if you want to play fortnite mobile on pc set up all of the in-game keys with these keys and just play fortnite thanks for watching please subscribe like and comment